we all sense the promise that comes from the arrival of approved, safe, and effective COVID vaccines. Through the tremendous work of Health Commissioner Judy Persichelli and her team of medical and scientific experts, and despite many obstacles, we have in place a plan to vaccinate every willing New Jerseyan adult resident, and hundreds of thousands have already rolled up their sleeves. Six vaccine megasites are opening across the state, and vaccinations will be available in hundreds more places statewide. We've already streamlined the vaccination process to enhance efficiency and ensure that if you choose to receive your first vaccine dose, you'll get the proper follow-up shot. I hope you'll take a moment to visit covid19.nj.gov slash vaccine to learn about the safety and effectiveness of the vaccines available to us. And by the way, you can pre-register for your own vaccination. And as our statewide vaccination program continues to grow, we will begin to see the light on the horizon get a little bit brighter. Be assured, we will get back to being able to gather and celebrate with our families and friends. We will be able to see all our children back in the schools they love. We will see our economy recover and flourish. You've heard me say that public health creates economic health. Our commitment to this ideal is unwavering. Everything together shows the promise of the new post-COVID day that is just beginning to dawn. It's a day we will enter not fearing what's next, but knowing where we're heading. And that direction is forward. 12 days ago, we welcomed a new year. But while the calendar has changed, our mission has not. When I first asked for the privilege to serve as your governor, I pledged to do what was right, not for my next election, but for the next generation. And that is how we have governed. We are who we said we would be. We stand with New Jersey's hardworking middle-class families and everyone working to get there. We haven't sugarcoated our problems and we haven't followed the same old Trenton playbook of kicking them down the road for someone else to deal with. A year ago, we had no idea of what 2020 would throw at us. As the poet Langston Hughes wrote, and I quote him, a dream deferred is a dream denied. And for so many, 2020 was a year of deferred dreams. But we stuck together, even in the darkest of days, as the New Jersey family we are. Out of shared pain, we forged shared purpose. And because of all we did together here in New Jersey, 2021 can be the year where dreams are once again possible and the wind is at our back. So when we emerge from the darkness of the pandemic together, we will be stronger, fairer, and more resilient than before. And we will be prepared to move forward as one state and one family.